Hello, this is Natasha Sinayobie on Ugandan All Stars. Okay, I get my hands really, really dirty. I do farming. This girl puts on gumboots and she puts on dungarees and goes out and does her farming. I do farming. Um, I, it's, it's, it's been a passion of mine, like one of those things that you would want to do at one point in life. Because everybody has to eat. Let's just accept that. So I decided to do it. And it's a good thing. Like I do, I do maize, I do fruits, I do ginger. So yeah. Like every girl, I would say every time, every girl should always save her money. Whenever you work, always save your money. You never know what to do for you. So with me, I saved my money and that's what I did. I started with very little. I started with one, two, until I got to a point where I felt like, yes, right now I have enough land and I started doing this. Uh, when I was doing my A levels and my O levels, I always wanted to be a doctor. And every time I did, I did sciences throughout. So uh, the only downfall to this is that I'm very squish. I fear blood like so bad, and um, that's how I diverted and I did IT. Yeah. No, not not now, because I'm I'm juggling so many things, but I do want to go back because right now it's what's driving this world. So I really want to go back and what they call a refreshes course, like refresh everything up. Then I would want to do something because I would want to really use my degree for something. Yeah. It's it's never too late to do anything in life. I would so much advise like anyone. If you ever make a mark in your life, never think that it's very it's too late for you to do anything. Definitely even now I can say, you know what, if I want to be a doctor, I want to be a doctor. Let me look at red blood, like just like any other liquid, but just never think that you can ever give up. Trust me, any time of your life, life can start at that particular point. I should say marriage has never been a thing I always look at and say it's what makes me and the person I'm with an item. Marriage definitely is the one where you go and you say I do's and put the ring on someone's finger. I think to me it starts with commitment. You can be committed to someone even without the ring on your finger. That's what makes a marriage. That's what builds to... I think this is just a metal. A ring is just a metal with a beautiful stone on it. But everything else comes from the heart, the commitment, heart and head, like commitment, how you treat each other, mutual understanding, connection, that's different. It's not something you just saying, putting a band on someone's finger is what makes it. Right. Yeah. I'm not in a hurry to get married yet. It will happen, eventually it will happen, right. but I'm not, yet. I'm not in a hurry. I'm going to confess, like, I've not used so much of social media because I'm, I, I would want to do that in 2016, but I haven't used so much of it because I've been so busy. It hasn't been something I've been using mostly, but I want to change it in 2016 because I think it's what drives the world right now. Everything like business, anything you do, it's kind of something that pushes it. But it has changed so much from then anything and everything and irrelevancy and relevant stuff is all there and uh, we're making such a big deal we as people making a big deal about it that it has actually changed how we live day to day business wise your daily life you from the time you get out of your bed to the time you go to sleep you're on your phone you understand so it's really I don't know if it's an upgrade or a downgrade. I don't know because we live in our phones right now. Nimzuri sana, sante kuni kunita niongena wewe. It was really nice. It was. Really